Just too much time. fold it in, David. How do you how do you fold it in? You just fold it in. The cinching belt that it comes with. <laughs> That's <laughs> fine. <laughs> Everyone and welcome to Like Mother, Like Daughter. Today we're going to compare our two Noe's. I've got the Noe BB and I've got the Petite. And what's odd is normally you would think that the mom would have the bigger bag. Yeah. But I decided to get the smaller one because I like those crossbody option or shoulder strap. It holds a lot. Well, this holds a lot too, but I like that it was vintage and I don't like the boot. Yeah. This little thing, I don't like it. I hate it. It's kind of scary too because it's, you know, anywhere that you set it. It's... Well, yeah, this has a leather bottom as well. I just didn't like the look of the boot. Well, can I see the bottom? Okay, so I never even really noticed that. So you still has the leather, you just can't see it. Yeah. Yeah. Now this one, when I got it, it did have a stain, a watermark. When I got mine, it did have a watermark. And again, because you've got the boot, you know, you're gonna get that. So you have to kind of not mind it so much, I guess. I don't understand when they released it, re-released it, why it didn't come out with treated Vachetta. That would have been really smart. Yeah, I uh, I don't know. But they just came out with a new one with feet. They revamped it. Revamped it. That is so cool. I would be interested in that. But yeah, I haven't carried this one that much yet. So I'll have to see how much I actually carry this one. I've had it for over a year. But I've only carried it one time. I think I've had this since last summer. And I carried it a lot. Yeah. But I just don't carry that much stuff. So it's like a more of a travel bag for me. It's cute, big bags are in right now. So yeah. it, kinda, it can be slouchy and stuff, yeah. And it's another bag that you can just grab just to throw stuff in. Yeah, you don't have yeah. to organize it all. All right, so we're gonna get into what the BB holds first. I'm gonna move her to the side. Now you can see I've got her, well, let me see here. Got her pretty cinched, cinched off. She's snatched. Yeah. Got snatched, little weights. Now you can't zip it completely closed so if that bothers you, this is not the bag for you. Um, originally the Noe's were actually made to carry wine. Yes, that's like the famous story of it. Is that the big one? The, what would that one be? That's just the non The Noe. Yeah. Um, but they could carry, I think it was exactly 12 bottles. 12? Oh, I think so. I think it was 12. Yeah, maybe I six. I thought it was five. Oh. Well, maybe it was five. That would make sense. One, two, three, four. So. Insert how many I could fit here. <laughs> Um, and so the Noe was one of the top three original bags that Louis Vuitton made. As far as I know, there was the Elma, the Speedy, and the Noe. And so it's a classic. Yeah, it's a classic. Yep. All right, as I am all over the place, so I'm gonna undo her. Okay, so this is what it looks like inside. All filled up. It's a great bag for you because you carry a lot of things. Well, sometimes I do, like I can, it depends on my bag. It depends the on the day. bag. Well, even the day, like the bigger the bag, the more I will find to fill it with. But it's just so annoying for me. But the smaller the bag, like I can do a small bag now. I just have to be more conscious about what I'm putting in there. I guess. So got a little cute. Tell oh yeah, cute. I've got her dressed up for Easter, or well, not Easter anymore, but for spring. spring. Yeah. And I actually got this for the uh, around Valentine's Day. I think I showed her before. <laughs> Alrighty, so like I mentioned in my other video, there's one thing I almost always have with me, or she does, and that's my water. This is my smaller Fiji bottle of water. I could do regular size, like 20 ounce water as well. Um, I could not do a super tall one like hers, but just like a normal standard bottle of water would fit just fine. I've got my Max Mara sunglasses, which I also went on about, got them on sale at Off Fifth. At office? Who's office? Is it Saks? What happened to Saks? Saks off at the... If you know, you know. I mean, you know. Off Anyways, fifth. they're great glasses. And we've got the cosmetic pouch and the damier. And this holds quite a bit. Um, this is a smaller one. They do have a bigger one. So I've got some Dior lotion. This is the balm. Some Dior lipstick. 
<laughs> this is the lip glow. I actually have it on right now. Um, the lip maximizer from Dior. Do you have that on right now too? I do, yeah. My Evian, which I can't live without. Not by choice. My Merit concealer stick. Let's see, I've got my Anastasia eyebrow Anastasia. clear gel. Anastasia. 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 <laughs> you guys get it. <laughs> Don't you love being corrected by your daughter all the time? I think it's like a new trend lately I see. And then my Dior Clear Lip Liner. Do you have that on right now as well? I also have this on, yes. This works with any color. All right, so we're down to this. Now we've got our little Kiragamis. This is actually empty at the moment. Normally I put cards in it, I just didn't get to switch them over. But this is the small one. This is the medium sized Kiragami. Today I'm using this instead of my mini pochette. This is about the same size, although I am, I love this, but I really do think that the mini pochette actually holds more. The mini pochette oh, yeah, definitely. just holds so much, but this holds quite a bit. I mean, everything that I needed from there, just I wanted to do something different today. I use the mini pochette so much, so. Gum, flossers, Element, I'm on and off keto, so it's good to stay hydrated. Advil, can't leave the house without it. <laughs> Nose strep, hand sanitizer, headache medicine for migraines, which I don't know, some people probably kill me for saying headaches, but for migraines, if you know, you know again. <laughs> and nail clipper, which if you've seen our other video, don't leave the house without your nail clipper. You can use it for many situations. So that's her. This is from the 2024, is it 2023? This is just this last Christmas. Uh, and I kept this one, this animation, and Malibu actually kept the bigger one and the smaller one. And she's got that on her channel. She shows how we kind of like mixed them. Like I kept one animation and two plane, and she kept two animation and one plane. So that was kind of fun. Which I feel like I like the original Kiragamis better because the inside is leather versus just canvas. Yeah, it's a lot softer. Yeah. So then I've got my uh, Damier Bean Zippy wallet, the small wallet. Again, this is the only one I ever really need with me, but once in a while I will get a bigger, bigger wallet, like the organizer. I, I love to put stuff in there. If you give me space, I will fill it. It's just, it's gonna happen. My Chanel mirror. that for Christmas for my daughter and the Chanel mirrors I can't put it back in here but I think I mentioned it before are really nice because they've got one side that magnifies one side that's just regular got some airpods Gucci compact this is the uh, balm. balm works for everything from cuticles to dry hands and I'm gonna use it as a pillbox when I'm done. It was $50 on our website. Great gift, a little something special. And Gucci always packages, I think, so nice. Oh my gosh, the packaging is incredible. Like you can get, doesn't matter if you get a nail polish for, I mean the nail polish is like $40 or something, but you know, it's still, it's a nail polish. Yeah, and anything you order from Gucci, they, they're gonna package it with their comp, like signature packaging. Yeah, and sometimes you'll get like a little bag or something with it too. Mm -hmm. Car keys, two hair ties, and a partridge and a pear tree, and a hair clip. I hope you did a lot of partridge and a pear tree. <laughs> well, probably could. And there you go, she's empty. Um, let me throw everything back in here. Now I brought my pochette Matisse strap. Um, I did actually pick up, you can either get it off of the Pochette Matisse, or you can buy one like it separately for, I think it was around four or five hundred. That was so worth it because of this bag. Uh, it's all Vachetta, so if you get stuck in the rain or anything, I mean you've got the Vachetta everywhere else as well, but the same, you can use it as well with a Speedy, anything monogram, anything. I've even, I've switched it on my Damier too, just to have a little bit of fun, so. But, so you can either carry it just like this, or you can undo it and you can just pop this one right on. I 
And of course you could use a million other straps as well. Yeah, but. I'd probably use a sporty strap. That's how it looks. Look at that. Um, you can also use like all the guitar straps and stuff. I do plan on getting the um oh, the crossbody bum bag. Mm, and that's yes. got a really cute guitar strap. And I think that would look absolutely adorable on here too. So you can really play around and have fun um, with any of Louie's bags, just like with the dressing up, you know. Um, make it more your own. Um, people used to carry these a lot more, I think, the Noe's because it's a classic, but honestly, with the Noe's, the Speedies, the Almas, I haven't been seeing them out as much as they used to be. I see the Neverfull I've never a lot, seen so. a vintage Noe. Yeah, I mean, I see them like on online, like I see, you know, pictures of influencers and stuff carrying them, but I just don't see them out as much. So I think it's kind of cool that they're becoming more rare to see, and so that much more special when you do get to see them. Yeah. So, all right, well, let's see yours. Yes, Petite Noe, and I love this Noe because it doesn't have the boot. I don't like the boot. I, it just it just annoys me. Like, why, why did they add a boot? I don't like when they change original class, like classics, like the Dauphine. I know Nicholas Jeshire is a great designer, but he just went way too far with the Dauphine. Like, I just want the Dauphine. Not the Dauphine hobo and the Dauphine bucket and whatever else he's done with the Dauphine. Just... They made it a belt as well, I think. Yeah, and it's just like, I feel like it's kind of a disrespecting the original designer when you constantly recreate it into something different. Yeah, it's I like it's that. not the same bag anymore. Yeah. Yeah. They didn't do that much different. I just don't like the boot. I can't explain it. Yeah. I don't mind the boot. Except for that it makes me nervous. But I yeah. bought it with a big watermark on it already, so it's kind of like that first ding on a new car. It's like, okay, well, it's yeah. already got the ding, so it's okay. Well, that's why I like vintage as well, because it's already been used and abused. Like, it came with a nice patina, which, another fact, I don't like this naked well, this isn't even, this is, this is already getting a little bit honey. It's a little bit more naked here. I hate new Vachetta. Here. It just, I love I'm it. just like, ugh, no. I love like, the smell. Dye of her, it. please. Like, uh, get her in the sun. Hold her with your hand lotion. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. It's a Louis My never. favorite is Honey Bettina, but her Polo Sean is more honeyed. Yeah, and that's your key ball. What color would that be? A darker, darker honey. honey but yeah anyways on to what's in my bag this is obviously bigger so it's obviously gonna carry more I didn't center up that much because the uh, what is this strap the cinching belt that it comes with <laughs> <laughs> the leather cord belt maybe cord sure it's I need to condition it because she's getting a little dry but also, like, I don't know, it just doesn't cinch that well for me. Yours is nice because it has this, which... Yeah. I don't see that on all of them. No, I think you can buy this aftermarket, too. Oh, okay. Because okay. that's nice. I, I like that. I think they come with a BB, but I, I could be wrong. I'm not sure. But, yeah, I'm pretty sure you can buy them. I know you can buy them aftermarket, so... So, first things first, if you can't see something peeking out of here, first of all... But <laughs> I can fit my huge Yeti in here. Oh. I don't know how many ounces that is, like 32, but it's like big it's metal. Big mama. Yeah. 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 I can fit that in here. I mean, will it crush everything else? Yes. Maybe it'll be hydrated. I'll be very hydrated and uh, it cooled because <laughs> yes. it can have ice in it. Yes. And in the south, you need your cooled water, which doesn't sweat all over the place. Oh my gosh, the condensation. Yes. Everything clear condensates. the condensation mm -hmm. but i have my life water in here which i love life water they say electrolytes for taste but we all know it's good for you yeah there's not really enough electro like if you're doing keto or something you want to rely on this for your electrolytes it's probably not gonna do it but no. but, but if you're size, just working out normally yeah, size comparison that was a 33 ounce bottle it's a liter it's a liter of water and so you can see that you could stick it into this one too yeah it just might look a little it funny. would just stick out the top but that's fine it's, it's fine, fine. <laughs> <laughs> and next to hers even hers it sticks out of the top so yeah. it's a one liter bottle yeah. i'm currently drinking it so that's why it's out <laughs> next i have my max mara sunglasses as well that we showed in the other bag video and my medium kirigami, the red one from the original collection, and all my lip products in there. 
Um, this time, four lip products. Oh, we gained I one. I think, yes. I don't know. I might have had four last video. I don't know. Brits Bees and three Dior's. Yeah, I still have to try the oil and the big fluffy brush. Yes, you need to get the fluffy <laughs> brush. You do, do you like fluffy brushes? I do like fluffy brushes. Yeah. I like fluffy brushes, I cannot lie. <laughs> I'm so going in. I know. This is my mini pochette. This is my prized collection. This is this is my baby. I need to get more pochettes. Yeah, I don't think you can have enough pochettes. Like I only have two and I want at least 20. Like Yeah, and they're just so cute. And it's like nice to be able to have an illustration without having to carry it and show it everywhere. Yeah. Like I love my little makeup uh, bag that I just showed. But honestly, like I'd prefer to just have the pochette. Like, I mm -hmm. mean, because I can carry it if I need to, I can put on a D ring inside my purse. I swear it holds just as much, or at least almost. Yeah. And um, it's so easy to clean as well. Yeah, and again, if you get the cute little illustrations, like I don't personally always like to carry around personally. something yeah, personally. Something with an animation. I mean if I want to I can add something but then i can take it off and just have a more clean look i don't always want to feel like that kind of kiddish look you know it's okay it's not kiddish <laughs> it just like feels more fun a little less sophisticated yeah which is fine sometimes uh candy mania is it chocolate Choc chocolate i think maybe maybe something i don't know in the men's collection you include picture here um i want the bum bag i need the bum bag yeah. It's, I don't know. I don't know why I need it. I don't know why it's so cute, but it is, and I need it. Yeah, and that's very colorful. That's very cute. Yeah. And we'll we'll just you'll have the original bum bag. Well, you won't have the original. Someday I'll have the original, but that thing's going for like thousands and thousands way over. Yeah, you should have gotten it when you told to. Uh, well, anyways. <laughs> Mini pochette. I have my mirror, little compact pocket mirror, and. My bomb. The bomb. Le bomb. I'm not French. Please don't <laughs> make fun of me. Yeah, trust me. Like some of these words are not gonna come out the way you everybody just, else pronounces. Yeah, we all My, have our own our own way of saying them. We do. My wallet. Wallet. I call it a wallet. It, well, know. on the website, it's called coin pouch or purse. Okay. I think they changed the name because I swear it used to say wallet. I think they did too. Uh, a tripod because we do vlogs. If you haven't seen any of those, you should watch them. Yeah, yeah, we're just getting started, but yeah. uh, showing you some interesting things that we do from day to day. Yeah, I mean, we're not the most interesting people, but you know, sometimes you need a little mundane in your life. <laughs> we have fun, we have fun at it. We have fun that we're documenting um, and saving memories. And uh, we talked before about, you know, if there's things that we can suggest or help people with, we want to do that or just yeah. show that you can have like a fun relationship with mother, mother daughter, even if you can't talk. <laughs> <laughs> Here's back to the purses. Yes. <laughs> um, and then I have a Trader Joe's mini reusable tote, like the Did bag that comes that out viral some point yeah it did and now oh my gosh you haven't even seen a mini tote bag like this but like a little bigger and all colors went out and it's going for like thousands of dollars i saw it's a so clip. crazy i, saw a clip I of want it. the yellow one so bad it's so cute that was adorable but there's no way on any planet that i would ever pay thousands no. of dollars for those. i would rather get a lily thank you that but here's this i just think um in our day and age there's a lot of stores that charge you to have some plastic bags mm -hmm. and if you have dogs sometimes you need a plastic bag <laughs> sometimes you just need a good plastic bag yeah but this is a bag and it this will also be a bag this can hold your coins you can hold keychains keychain yes so cute it is absolutely adorable i'm not gonna fold it back in like david because that just takes <laughs> just too much time fold it in david how do you how do you fold it in you just fold it in if you say fold it in one more time just fold it in, David. Okay, but how do you fold you just it? Just do it. Just do it. <laughs> and my phone, which has a little Dior, uh, what is it? Pop socket, but not pop socket. It's like a phone ring. Yeah, phone ring. But very cute. She got it for me for Christmas. Yeah. 
Yeah, it was a gift actually. Um, gift with purchase? I think it was a gift with purchase, or maybe because I was new to Dior Cosmetics. Maybe. They okay. have different ones every year. So I got that last Christmas and then this Christmas I got a phone charm. Yeah, so if you like cosmetics at all, make sure you try Dior's, um, sign up for their program because they have the best gifts with purchase mm -hmm. for their cosmetics. Yeah. I have tons of videos, uh, all due to her and her Dior addiction. I went a little bit nuts. Now, but as much as I love their gifts with purchases and all that stuff, you do have to be careful because most of the stuff contains pretty strong perfume. So yeah. the couple items you've seen my lip products and the balm are pretty much the only ones I can handle. I've ordered a few other ones, even just like a their basic eyeshadow. eyeshadow. Hmm. I almost fell over. My eyes hurt for a couple weeks, and all I did was open it, and but because my eyes smells are so like sensitive. my great aunt Tessie. Yeah, yeah. So they are starting to come out with more natural products. The lip products I showed you today, those are like ninety eight percent, but they're still not hundred. So you know, hopefully they'll get there. Yeah, hopefully. And the last thing, honestly, I don't carry around my makeup bag all the time. This is from Dior as well, but. Since I had the space to do so, I put this in there. This is just all of the makeup that you see on my face right now, basically. And that was another gift with purchase or yeah. something like that. Yeah, for the Lunar New Year. <gasps> yeah, so I spread. It's so pretty. And all of my makeup products, which one day you will see what we have in our makeup bags. Yeah. But that's not the day of today. Not today. <laughs> this is the bag empty. And it's honestly, if I, I think they might have organizers for them. Oh yeah, they have organizers for even like the smallest, smallest bags. Because so. it can be a black hole. Yeah, I mean it's a times. bucket bag. I think any bucket bag. Really. Here's the bottom, which is a gorgeous tanned leather. But you cannot just set this willy nilly on the ground. But the new refurbished one, you can. Because of the feet. Well, technically, I mean. Technically, it has feet, but you know, still, if you set it on a table, if you sit, still, it's gonna. If you go out to a restaurant, put it next to you on your booth. Yeah, I get one of those like little purse hooks they have. I haven't. Um, In France, one, they but... just have those. Like they'll they they either offer you a little chair for your purse, wow, or really they'll cool. have hooks on the table. Which cool. America, catch up. Yes, come on. Yes, we, we have our bags, bags too. <clears throat> but. That's it for my bag. All right, so size comparison side by side. Let's see. I don't know, that one just does not want to cinch as well. I don't know, it's kind of twisted here. Yeah, I mean, it's fine. She's from 1996, give her a break. You would think she'd be like more like well worked in then though. Yeah, oh, it also has a D-ring on the inside that you can connect your mini pochette to, or your keys. Granted, I guess, if she's like a woman, and you're, the older you are, the more set in ways you get. So maybe she just doesn't want to move. She does. So, she's old. No, I'm not budging. This is it. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the BB. This is the petite. And we're going to show you a couple mod shots for size reference. Um, the strap can also come off of here. I would recommend... We can do front. Oh, that's cute. I would recommend a wider strap if you do want to change the straps on this because if it carries more it gets more heavy so it won't dig into your shoulder as much yeah and i think these are probably mine is thicker she's thick. no, actually okay so yours is like thick deeper it's like thick thicker this way she thick um you're just slim thick yeah mine is slim slimmer i don't know if that's because it's newer i think so um, width-wise, they seem to be the same. Length-wise, I'm not sure. We'll, well have to check that. Yours is longer. Oh, because it's crossbody. Yeah. This one should technically be longer. I have this on the longest strap setting, though. Um, if let's see. that's the correct terminology. As far as adjustments go on this one, it's got one, two, three, four, five on this side. One, two, three, four, five, five on that side. So I only have five adjustments. Oh yeah, I have five adjustments as well. And I don't think personally for me. Personally. Personally. This one's as short as it can go, and I don't think this would be short enough for me to use as a um, shoulder. shoulder bag. I would have to use one of my other straps. As long yeah. as I did use another strap, it would be fine, it'd be cute, but I'd have to you use You could use one. mine, but it's more patinaed. Yeah, yeah, that would work. That's a great idea though. They're really, I love how they've got the uh, engraving and the rivets. 
Let's see. I don't know if you can see that. What are they called? I think they're called rivets. What would you call them? I don't know. It's just a funny word. I don't even know if you can see that on there, but... On the sides, they also have Louis Vuitton Paris. Oh, and yeah. Made in on this side. Yeah. Well. Mine's right there. Um, they're I know. Where's the day codes? Mine is, like, tucked in on the side. I don't know. And it's very hard to see, which sucks. There's, like, a nano. There's, there's a nano noise. Yeah. Which... If you don't carry stuff, I guess that's the purse for you. Well, I mean, though, I don't know exactly how small the nano is. It's like is, a little pixie is, dust. This is the BB, and I am shocked at how much this thing holds. That thing, it, it's an everyday bag. Yeah, this thing holds everything I need and more. This holds way more than my pochette Matisse. It holds probably, honestly, close to, if not just speedy. as much as my Speedy. Yeah, Maybe. which you can easily have a water bottle in there. Yeah, I mean, I didn't you can see everything stuffed. in there. Especially yeah. with your blindness. <laughs> yes. It does really help to see when it opens right from the top, especially when you are blind like me. Yes. One thing that's great about this, if you go to church and you need something to carry your Bible, I have a big Bible. And this carries a big Bible. Mm -hmm. So if you need a bag to carry a Bible, I would recommend a Patino A. Or books. Or, um... If you ever go to the movies and you want to sneak a few things in, because yes, I brought this to the movie. I think I brought this to Elvis. To Elvis, oh yeah, that was a really good movie. Um, so you can use it for lots of no, things. No, I didn't. You no, can. I brought no? it tonight room for Christmas. Oh okay. You could probably stick snacks and a little sweater rolled up in here. Honestly, definitely yeah. in there. I, I could mean, fit a blanket in this. If I put a pair of shoes in there. And a partridge in a pear tree. I could fit a whole entire Thanksgiving dinner in here. Well, you know, I like to say. They're all Mary Poppins bags. <laughs> yeah. um, but where do we find the date code on here? I don't know. I, didn't look. I thought it was created after a date code. Went away. Oh no, it's SA0280, so 2020. So in order to find your date code on yours. Eighth week in France, 2020. We're going to look on. Let's see, it looks like the side. Both of the sides have a Louis on it. But the ones one of the France. sides will have it right in here. Mm -hmm. I can't see it. So, but um that's only if it was made before 2021 because remember they stopped with the date codes and it just went to um chips, which I was really bummed out about. Yeah, and I didn't like that. Seems like their inventory really started to fill up too. I think a lot of people were really bummed about that. It's like this is history. Yeah. This is fashion history and they modernize it, but really it's just taking away from being able to authenticate the bags better. Yeah, which might work in their benefit, honestly. In I'm Louis' not, benefit, but not yeah. their um, lover's benefit. I'm not into little conspiracy theories and all that stuff very much, honestly. But at the same time, like, I don't need my things being tracked by chips either. So that kind of just kind of like tripped me out, tripped out some people. So anyways, we will get our mod shots up here for you guys. And... Thank you so much for watching today. Yep, this is very weird because I have the bigger bag and you have a smaller bag. It is backwards from normal, but it works. Um, so that's what was in her Noe's. Yep, she's got the Petite Noe and I've got the BB Noe. And if you guys have any questions or suggestions about these bags, any other bags that we might have in our collections, please leave them in the comments below. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Make sure to click that notification bell to be notified of our future uploads. Yep, and we hope to see you all soon. Bye. Bye.